me up on 515 this morning, about 90 minutes southeast of Indianapolis, you'll find the Boyd family pumpkin display. I love this family. Yeah. For the past three decades, people have been driving hours to see the hundreds of hand carved pumpkins on display, and it's all for a good cause. So I made the trip. Okay down to a small farm located between North Vernon and Zenus, Indiana. All right. All right. And I found out the hype is real. For most of the year, the Boyd family farm down in North Vernon is just your typical Indiana farm. But for nine days every October, it transforms into the Boyd pumpkin display with hundreds of pumpkin designs for everyone to enjoy. We might carve upwards over 400, 450 pumpkins through the course of the display, just trying to keep them looking fresh. How many years you guys been doing this? This will be our 29th year. How many years do you want to do this? Next year may be it. No. Yeah. <laughs> As you can tell, Melody Boyd wants to keep this pumpkin display going for years to come. Her husband, Wesley, not so much. If it's so much work, why do you do it? To see the smile on the kids' face. Melody, what kind of reaction do you get from the people who come see this pumpkin display? You're crazy. <laughs> letting all these people in your yard every year. Wesley and Melody don't charge admission. They just put a donation jar out, and then the boys donate that money to a local charity. But it's just my way of giving back. The hundreds of pumpkins would cost the Boyd family more than $1,000, but all these pumpkins are actually donated to the Boyds every year by Adam Fryan at Partican Sons Farm, free of charge. I'm the setup guy, and I normally end up getting everything out there and setting everything up. She does all the cooking and yep. getting everything ready for all the carvers. About 20 or so locals donate their time to carve all these pumpkins. We got people that carve, and they love to come carve, and that's part of it. They actually have a special scraping technique using an X-Acto knife to save time. Not everybody wants to carve. Some people, they just want to come help, so we'll put them a gut or maybe just drawing on pictures. The pumpkin designs are truly unique, and the boys try to work in a small theme. We try to do a Disney section every year. One this year we're done celebrating Disney World's 50th anniversary. Is this the biggest event in North Vernon? In Zenith it is. In Zenith so. it is. <laughs> but it did get me on the Today Show one time. At spring break, I took a sign with us, and we went to the Today Show, and I put a jack-o'-lantern pumpkin on the top of it. Willard Scott saw it and wanted to know why I had a jack-o'-lantern lantern sign in March, so he came over and talked to me. And the pumpkin fame doesn't end there. We are now in the Indiana Registry of Things to See in the State of Indiana in October. I think that's kind of cool. That's pretty cool. So now back to that first pressing question. You guys think you have one more year of this? We got more than that. <laughs> she says we do, but I'm tired. We're not quitting yet. <laughs> He wants to keep going. All the pumpkin pictures you just saw are from past years because the boys actually start carving the pumpkins today and tomorrow oh. so that they're fresh for the display, which starts on Saturday and okay. runs through Halloween. Because, I mean, these pumpkins, yeah. they get rotten. You yeah, know? that's true. We have directions to the farm at WTHR.com. Yeah. And the thing is, too, like we do the Battle of the Bulbs every mm -hmm. year, and people can just keep bringing those same bulbs out every year, the same displays. Right. you got to have fresh pumpkins. Yeah, yeah so you got to you got to start right. up yeah. from scratch with 400 yeah. pumpkins yeah. every year. They're I adorable. By the, way. the couple, yes, yeah, right. love them. I can't believe that they, they said they have. Some people don't watch you want to carve the pumpkins, so they still put them to work. They like, put you them, know what? Get, put them on gut. Listen, yeah, put them you got to do something. Love that. Awesome. <laughs>